Viva la vegan! Hello, I'm Lee Chantel from vivalavegan.net. Welcome to this week's question and answer. It is, when you have kids, will you force them to be vegan? Hmm, this question is asked by many non-vegans all the time to vegans and mostly asked with an air of judgment. I also prefer the term children to kids as kids are baby goats, which I love. I have no children and I don't plan on having any and I don't really see a reason why I would want to. But I am around various children of various ages, from my nephew who just turned one to a lot of my friends' children and I also interact with other people's children on a professional basis. With other people's children and I would assume if I had my own, I would encourage them to be the best version of themselves at all times. I would encourage them to be inquisitive, compassionate and kind in every area of their life. And veganism to me is um, the natural outcome of all of these things. Children are brought up in families with unhealthy relationships, addictions, lack of proper attention and care and lack of respect and many, many other things. For people who think that being in a vegan environment is a bad thing for a child, I'd seriously be trying to find out why they think this way. I think the key part of the question that's been asked of me is the word force. And I don't believe that you can force another person to be vegan. You can only lead by example and encourage questions and be supportive. And I hope that every vegan out there does these sort of things. Just as I would not agree with smoking, drinking, doing drugs or acting in a disrespectful way towards others when I'm around a child who is very impressionable, I would strongly believe in acting in a loving, compassionate, supportive way when I'm around children and the world at large. My version of compassion and doing the best I can as a person on this earth starts with being vegan. I show this in my day-to-day -day life and I would definitely be the same person around children and I hope that you would choose to do this too. I hope that's answered your question, what do you think about this? I know um, people that are with other people that are not vegan, this might be a problem. And I know that this with anything is all about compromising. So for example, one of my friends is about to get married and her partner is vegetarian and doesn't really understand the benefits of health benefits of a vegan for children. So they have agreed and compromised that their child will be brought up as a vegetarian. So there's all these different things that you can try to do within your relationship and your family. I'd love to know what works for you. Please share your comments in, in the below comments section. And I look forward to seeing you next week and on vivalavegan.net and across our social media channels. Next week's question is, what do you think of palm oil? I'll see you then.